no, holds exactly. three bases. Anyhow, this is a, a big ZVZ coming up, guys. Um, yeah. We can do a little bit of a background. Game has that. Okay. Let's just introduce the players first. Yep, so we have. Uh, yeah. Um, I have to put the screen on. Okay. We have Starbuck in the upper left corner of the map as the red zone. And we have a, a legend. You <laughs> know him. Um, it's Eonus. Uh, green, blue, alike, Zerg. Yeah, it's teal actually. Teal, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. So yeah, just uh, oh. we can do a quick recap during this downtime. Downtime. Uh, like Eonus was like the best player in Slovenia before mm -hmm. Starbucks started to dominate, right? I mean, yeah, Eonus is probably the most renowned player uh, besides Starbucks in Slovenia. Yeah, he most yeah. definitely is, and yeah. he was dominant almost unbeatable for two years and then he went inactive and started to play in Terran a bit and that's when Tarbuck came out so this is the first match we see them play yeah uh, this is actually the first official uh, official yeah, map uh, between them I think yeah mm -hmm. of lead on leather of course but you know leather is not really that much serious and we can we'll, I think we'll see some great games coming out from both of them. And we already see Starbuck going for the 15 hatch. Uh, yeah, while weirdly enough. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> well, uh, also Ian is going for the same, I think. Uh, yeah, oh. both going for the 15 hatch, pretty standard. Although in ZVZ it's not as... Uh, they say it's not as safe, but it became safe since uh, then there's not so many cheese openings anymore. Yeah, and the map is large, so we have yeah. to take account as well. The only uh, thing Aaron that spots the <coughs> spawning pool now, pretty even timings though. Yeah, 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 pretty even. Yeah. Basically, it's like <laughs> the same timing on both things. Uh, although Starbuck has once okay, no, no more one supply ahead. Uh, going for a bit faster gas than Eonis, uh, so that means he will have that faster speed or banings. Considered what will what does he prefer? Most yeah, likely speed wise. Um, on the other hand, I'm just taking the gas right now. Yeah, uh, with the delayed gas doesn't change that much. Uh, only that perhaps a drone or two more drones in the in this start, but not a yeah, big deal. Not really a difference. Yeah, exactly. Um, a bit of a supply block coming out from uh, Eonus, uh, forgetting his Overlord. Yep. Uh, only now starting it, so we'll see a little bit of a supply block. Um, otherwise, everything is going as usual, as we can say for uh, Z uh, ZVZ. <laughs> yeah, this supply box was really bad, I think. Yeah, it actually a pretty big supply block. Couldn't he couldn't start his second queen? He couldn't start his drones or zerglings. So he immediately immediately put down four more drones to the production. So yeah, uh, even the first queen was delayed, but. No one is aggressive, so it doesn't really count much. Yeah, since Starbuck doesn't didn't go for any aggressive. Uh, the two on the way, but more of a scouting purpose, as I would say. Yeah, the two links will only just poke in to see what's going on, how many drones are on the expansion, or what's up, and just Both to check out the speed stuff. And Starbuck won't make it into the main base, most likely. Trying to snipe a drone, good, good call, but per he won't. Nah, he won't. Yeah, go. he he survived. Nice try, He's yeah. making a very fast bailing nest, Starbuck, in his natural. Yep, he is. Yeah, and right now he has six drones queued up, and I think he wants to try some of an aggressive play, uh, probably some bailing bust, but doesn't want to go really all out on this. Yeah, he's just is following with a bailing nest of his own, and um, scouting a bit with his links. He's yeah, overlords. This might be uh, link heavy play. Yeah, uh, right. as you have said, yeah, ten links on the way already. Probably additional more when additional larva spawn. Fourteen, sixteen links, eighteen links. Eighteen links, yeah. Yeah, so he really wants to do some damage here and. Uh, Twenty-two Ian's, links. Yeah, Ian is have to, has to be careful. I mean, if he does, okay, he sees he sees more links. He sees speed done already. He sees the the gas still being taken. He also saw the banning and so. It, it's very strange though, uh, the overlords of uh, Yeah, Eonos, Eonos are, are, are not, not spread out, world. yeah, they're all like in his main and right now bailings are a lot uh, delayed from Eonos and this could hurt a little bit. Yeah. Uh, but at least the bailings are there, so... 
Right now, uh, Starbuck is already morphing. Three more banings, Ooh, nice two banning already popped. Shot. Yeah, nice banning shot. They actually didn't do anything. Killed maybe two or three uh, Zerglings. The Queen's really good targeting on them. Um, yeah, but he's gonna survive. Too much yeah, for Yeah, Yannis will survive easily. Uh, A big vocal lead for Starbuck though, but... Yeah, he he perhaps overextended with those uh, two banelings. I mean, if he didn't lost them to just the queens, it would be much better if you ask. He's gonna prepare for the counter attack. He's making a wall in with Roach War. But I, that's not a perfect wall in. Links can uh, can yeah, get it. Yeah, it's not. But yeah, he can place a queen. He can yeah, place exactly. a queen there. So. Yeah, exactly. That's that's true. So the banelings are on the way. A lot more banelings for Starbuck. Yeah. And there's a lot. There's a, there are lots of links coming out from the units, and right now they're in front of. Oh, careful! Draws one uh, bailing in front. Perhaps want to lose. A lot of bailings. Oh, a lot oh. Of he has to be careful. Oh, nice, uh, nice. Yunus should oh. stand right now. Nice. I think. <laughs> Big bomb coming out from Starbuck, killing all the bailings from Yunus, uh, and that was a, that was a great start for Starbuck. I mean, yeah, he yeah, just nice. killed. Four bailings, I think, something he like also that. Has four gases while uh, Jonas is just now taking the second two. Yeah, it's and uh, a much faster spire for Starbuck, I think. Hi, uh, perhaps EMP he from both players. Actually, uh, actually, actually Starbuck is going for roaches. Yeah, I just want to say that uh, not spire, but roaches, and he's gonna have a lot of roaches before uh, uh, Jonas even puts down his roach one. So yeah, Jonas true. might but die to this. So with upgrades. Yeah, well, he has speed on the way. He has plus one uh, uh, missile attacks, uh, and this Dropped could hurt a lot. Drops more. <laughs> exactly, and this is the timing. The one plus one plus two timing on uh, with roaches, and when you hit that, and the Zerg is not prepared, it's pretty damn good. Yeah, that's right. Also, the supply gap uh, is starting to show right now, 85 versus 70, and it's going to increase even more with more roaches in production. He's going to follow up with infestors as well, maybe after the attack. Yeah, great, a great decision from Starbuck. The infestors are actually a vital unit in the roach uh, composition, and if the, your opponent goes roaches as well, infestors do great damage. There's and quite a mistake here on the part. He has five drones in the gas in the main yeah, phase. Yeah, also Ionis' for how long. Oh, yeah. spire is late. It's so late right now that infestors uh, will already be out before his uh, mutalists yeah. start to get to Starbucks okay, base. The attack is here. Nice. All the oh, bailing start. Whoa, this was amazing. Yeah. yeah. And <laughs> this, gonna lose all this is off. not good. Plus one is also going to complete for Starbuck. Plus one missile attack that is, and this is going to hurt. Another queen will fall. More more He's roaches. Fire as well. Yeah. Maybe snipe it. Uh, I doubt he'll snipe it. He can just kill off these four roaches, and it's pretty much done. I mean, Starbuck yeah, is true. right now on a road to glory to win. And pl with plus one complete and speed, he can kite those uh, zero zero roaches without speed and. We can already see his microing uh, damage roaches away, and this is getting uh, pretty bad. This is looking pretty bad for Yunus. Yeah, and Starbuck is just making another army at home with infestors with 30, 25 more drones. No, <laughs> twice the drone count almost. Yeah, uh, I just wanted to say that some some people like to say like yeah he held he held up he didn't I mean he didn't die to that but you have to look at the, this way like Starbuck used like only initial 15 roaches per se and he killed with them all the reinforcements coming out from yeah, units and the initial army and that counts so much that it's just <laughs> it's he hard. has fast attack he has better upgrades yeah, he has he drones has, behind uh, much a better attack and yeah he managed to snipe two workers but still yeah. Two and right now, two paintings are making it to the worker Ooh. line of, uh, of <laughs> Starbuck, killing only one drone, I think. Yeah, one drone, yeah. Sad bailings. So, Ionis is currently in big, tro in a big trouble, in big troubles. Uh, oh my god, how can I pronounce that? Sorry. <laughs> plus two uh, missile attack for uh, Starbuck on the way, plus uh, more roaches, two more infestors coming out, and... Yeah, but but uh, no real anti-air, I think. I mean... At least not in the army. 
Yeah, but uh, uh, bases will be defended with spore crawlers, but there are already so many infestors on the map with uh, double uh, fungal growth, so the mutalisks are pretty much yeah, true, yeah. rendered useless as soon as uh, they, they get fungal. They won't fungled. really do enough damage to kill of the roach army, so... Yeah, the problem with mutalisk is that you have to ca catch your opponent off guard and <laughs> do an... Uh, do enough damage. If you don't do that, I mean, he might snipe one infester though. He threw yeah. those two infested Terran. <laughs> I don't, I don't know if this is micro coming out from you and it's like splitting those mutalisk okay, or yeah, there. The battle is already ongoing. Yeah. Uh, upgrade yeah, need yeah. for uh, Looks Starbuck very bad yeah. for you. Yeah, and also he decided to pull back since more roaches. Yeah, because he didn't of the want spine to crawl. fight of the spine crawl. Yeah, but now fungals are in their way and yeah, this seems like a big. Infested Terran is gonna spawn. Although the mutalisks are doing their damage, they're not worth it because before they could kill those roaches, it's gonna be over. And plus two a missile attack completing for Starbucks, so we should cheer GG pretty fast here. Yeah, he's gonna also the supply gap. Well. Oh, yeah. We can see the supply gap, it's uh, twice as much, so. Yeah. Drones this are falling. Is, yeah, everything is dying. Starbucks um, has three working bases, so. GG. GG coming out from me, and it's a fast game. Mm hmm. Um, a small yeah, it recap. was a pretty identical uh, build and attack, but we can see the Starbuck had much better ma uh, macro, or maybe I don't know. He did very well, very well, very well. <laughs> yeah, um, Starbuck did uh, quite uh, quite good, of course. Um, Ilnus, um basically. Is, didn't drone enough. He just didn't have the. He just, uh, he just just didn't have the economy, and that's what uh, brought him down. And of yeah. course, the push from Starbuck, the follow up plus one uh, with Roaches was just devastating. Losing so many units and drones in the process, of course, units, it was just too much. And the follow up with plus two Roaches and Investors was just yeah. yeah follow up was brutal, and also he killed all the Banelings and. Yeah, exactly. All, uh, all the links. Yeah, the counter from Ian was, was pretty much uh, destroyed as soon as those one. As soon as that one bailing killed like four or five bailings, and that's where yeah. the game just started to shift in uh, Starbucks um, Starbucks favor. Okay, so yep, the next map is going to be Daybreak. Oh, Daybreak coming out okay, from Ian. So yep, this is his pick. I'll make a lobby in a moment. A large map. Large map yeah. As well, yeah. Large a long, long rush. Distance. Yeah, exactly. So any early pools are pretty not that standard or roaches as well. At least not in that early of a game. Um, yeah, mut mutalisk, mutalisk is uh, actually, actually the most popular in in this uh, map. This yeah, map, exactly. Yeah. And Starbuck loves mutalisk, so. Yeah, so we probably see that. Although yesterday he didn't go for mutalisk in this map. This was the second map, I think. The last map, actually. Yeah, but uh, he, he went, went in for one battle. Yeah, he went. Match. Yeah, he went in the first match. He went for mutalisk and just demolished um, everything. Okay, yeah. so the game's is the game is loading, guys. Uh, it's in fair. Uh, sorry, uh, Eonus. Uh, his in-game na nickname is a bit uh, Inf off. Eonic, Inf yeah. He Eonic, changed yeah. his nick with uh, uh, when he went to the team in. Yeah, and Starbuck. Oh, no. By the way, you guys are watching Connecting Slovenia Arena Season 1. Uh, currently, it's 1 0 for Starbuck. Will you do the honors or? Um, yeah, I'll just one of them. Ionos has spawned in the upper right corner as the Teal Zerg player. Yay. Yay. Ooh, clap and that. his opponent. Um, yeah, his opponent. Got the first map. It's. Starbuck from he Team Derail. Starbuck! Woo <laughs> yeah, just clap then. Okay, so... <laughs> yeah, pretty second standard. Map is starting. Yeah, Not pretty, a, bit, a, bit of a, a bit of a downtime here. Is there's no early pool coming out from anyone. No 6 pool, 9 pool. At least not yeah. for now. Most likely it'll be a standard game uh, with uh, 15 hatch or 15 pool. So not It's gonna be a pool. bit of a downtime right now. Um, so uh, let's talk a little bit about. Uh, Eonos' overlords, for example. Yeah, his <laughs> overlords. 
spread it's pretty it's pretty uh, weird. I mean, usually in ZVZ you want all your overlords on the map and, uh, unless you recognize Metalist play. But he's he apparently likes to go for uh, everything in your expansion. Yeah, uh, <laughs> it was strange. He plays them uh, in every expansion, but not across the map. Yeah, basically I'm, not across the rush distance. So yeah, the. The thing is that with your overlords in ZvZ you can safely control, at least uh, in the start of the game, any kind of uh, hidden wannabe uh, rambis by your opponent because yeah. you have overlords yeah, everywhere without the threat of losing them. Yeah. Um, so, right now, oh, yeah, Starbuck Michael. opened with the uh, gas yeah. first, I think. Yes, yeah, first it's, the pool. Uh, 15 gas, 15 pool. With uh, uh, Ionus going into 15, uh, 15 hatch, 15 gas, 15 pool. So um, it's a bit deviation going for uh, with from Starbuck going for that. Um, so actually, what do you say? Yeah, no, Starbuck I'm mistaken. Guys, I'm here. mistaken. I didn't see that timing from Starbuck. It's 13 13. It's a yeah, 13 13. 13. Again. Yeah, so I, it's sorry. To be aggressive. Uh, yeah, it's to be aggressive and try to expand while. Some yeah, yeah Sarbak is going to try at least to, to do a damage on that hatchery and to kill some of the drones from Ionis. And Ionis really has to be careful. He has to put his bailing nest as, as soon as that uh, spawning pool completes because otherwise he won't be able to defend this. Mm. Uh, Starbuck and sees and the pool here. He's confident he can do some damage at least. Yeah, yeah also he's the two. Um, Starbuck's expansion, so he knows it's not a full all in. Yeah, uh, yeah, just knows it's. Uh, but usually, you ca you have the minerals at least in the beginning for that expansion, since the expansion comes in handy if it prolongs a little bit more with this push and yeah, you need for larva. So right he now, he also uh, sees the speed he's ma in making. He clicked on the spawning pool. Yeah, not that he needed to, but it's moving. Yeah, it's moving like dancing in the wind. <laughs> Yeah, um, it's pretty cool actually. <laughs> Starbuck doing damage to the hatchery. Ian is a bit res uh, resilient to go uh, attack those uh, zerglings with right cost since he doesn't know when the speed will complete. Yeah, and the first queen is out for uh, Eonus. I yeah, think he'll have to bring uh, her or eat yeah, or whatever. Most definitely. And the queen, if the queen spawns on the expansion, uh, yeah, that may fall. Oh, going yeah, directly into the main. The queen, He's snipe the queen the will queen. fall. Yeah, the main queen will fall. Falls, Perhaps a yeah. couple of drones as well will fall. But mainly. Yeah, it's gonna be hard to pick up drones right yeah. now. Yeah, not. But another queen will fall, which is a pretty, which is pretty bad. Or not. Or maybe oh, nice not. Place. Oh, nice, nice box. Ion is going in the corner yeah. there. And uh, Ion is going to finish, so yeah. Yeah, Ion does this great defense, but. If we look at uh, the worker count, Starbuck is one worker ahead because Ionis was just. I mean, Starbuck just forced so many Zerglings out of Ionis that right now he is ahead in uh, worker supply. This is a very fast Roach Warren for Starbuck. Plus yeah. one already going up. The other hand, uh, Starbuck is in a bit of a trouble since look at the number of Zerglings yeah. coming out from Ionis. And Starbuck. Yeah, this might is going to be pretty bad. Starbuck might lose a lot here. Like the queens, the two queens. Most definitely could fall. Yeah. Uh, 12 more Zerglings coming out from Starbuck and the Queens will fall, oh, yes. Yeah, that's bad, that's bad. So that means no more injects for Starbuck. Also, his drones were pulled. There was no economy for a couple of yeah. seconds there. He has more drones though, but still, no yeah. Queens means the queens no is, the Zero Queens is pretty bad because with that there's no larva and without larva you can do pretty much nothing. Um, Eonos is full all in. He has no drones in main. Transferred all to the natural. He's making yeah. pure links. Yeah. The the weird thing is that actually Starbuck is going for plus one missile attack. Although he's not mining any more gas for the roaches, which is like really weird. Uh, in the other hand, Starbuck yeah. is uh, in a lot of trouble. No economy. Drones are starting to fight versus Zerglings, which is never good. And this will actually be a win for uh, Eonos. Nice yeah, position. looks like it. He I should. Drones are dying. Uh, Ionis should be able to take this because the losses were just great right now for. But us. I wouldn't just call it the win because there are still the same amount of drones if you look at it. 16 drones versus 16 drones. 
Yes, maybe that's true, but doesn't realize it. But we we have to look at the production and the economy. I mean, while uh, Starbucks was fighting with the links with his drones, uh, Ionos was just basically droning. Be I mean, mining behind it, and his yeah, economy was way more uh, efficient than Starbucks. Yeah, and he started to make drones again. Yes, exactly. Four more drones on the way for uh, yeah. Ionos, and he feels confident. Also, two queens. Yeah, and. He feels confident that he did enough damage and probably is going to snap the hatcher and this is going to be big. This is going yeah, to be snap the hatcher. Yeah, this will the hatcher will fall and Starbuck knows he's in big trouble. Um, yeah, this is looking really bad, yeah, really green for Starbuck. Uh, without uh, without that expansion with um so lost uh, mining time uh, and only five roaches, it isn't looking exactly good. Even though uh, knows he's ahead, he should make maybe even more spine crawlers because he basically just needs to defend and then survive, and that's that. He's making yeah. approach war and defensive probably. Most that evolution chamber. Yes. Yeah, and even chamber for the probably for the plus one missile attack, um, which is common. Right Another now, Starbuck has to be careful. Cancel the base again. If Ionis manages to get us around on those roaches, it's gonna be big and. Nope. Cancel. cancel. Yeah. Good. Good nice pressure cancel, yeah. out. Yeah. Oh, uh, one base layer coming out from Starbuck with another uh, <laughs> <laughs> with another gas. I think uh, he's going to try Mutalisk. What do you guys think? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. But uh, I it's I mean, a long shot. Might see that. It, yeah, it's a long shot to go that, but uh, he perhaps wants to try it since he has no other way yeah. out of this. I almost saw the layer. Yeah, he saw the making of the lair and he has yeah, to know this. It's a strange move because if you have two bases, you have more queens and... Yeah, yeah, exactly. You can easily make four cores and five mutilists are not going to do anything. You need four for... Exactly. But you to make to it ten. Put the neutral down. Yeah, he's trying to regain his uh, expansion. But Ian is probably going to try another uh, cancel on that and... Every yeah, cancel... He's going to go in festers. Um, I mean, perhaps infestors is because they're good defensive the units, and you can actually do damage with them. Yeah. Um, yeah, and you can survive against link run bys. You can fungal all the links. Yeah, Starbuck going for plus two missile with uh, speed on roaches. Interesting choice, though. Um, perhaps not the best one, but he has to be really careful right now. Um, yeah, he does. There's still no upgrades for Eonus. He's making plus one for roaches, though. Yeah, on the other hand, if Eonus leaves Starbuck to regain his uh, natural expansion to get the economy up and running, it it won't be so great at all. I mean, uh, Starbuck probably yeah. knows that, that he shouldn't be um, shouldn't be leaving uh, but the base or something. Eonus already has more roaches and twice the count. To no, he has uh, ten more drones and twice the roaches. Yeah. So and he just decided to push while probably taking his. Oh uh, no, he's gonna not going to take his third. I thought it will be like that, but um, he and his, yeah, a smart decision. I mean, he knows Starbuck is currently in shambles, trying to re uh, remake remake his economy, but with yeah, the push he coming, four spine crawlers. Yeah, so. exactly, and n not even units. So right now, Starbuck is. Uh, not sh uh, looking to be in a good spot. <laughs> uh, nice, uh, yeah, nice conclave game. for Starbuck versus those uh, Zerglings, balls. but the roaches of Ionis are doing their damage. Even more come out, and oh, it's just too much. Yeah, lose this, one this is going much. to be a power battle, and the roaches of Ionis are go just going to roll over everything. There are it's so many. Interesting how. It's interesting how Ionus played this out because he didn't play for like a year or maybe yeah. he had some of accounts but he still has it in him. Um, yeah, do you think he didn't play a bit? But yeah, GG out of Starbuck and this is the first Slovenian to ever take a map from Starbuck. Ever. <laughs> yeah. yeah um, uh, just really? wanted to say that basically ever, right? now ever. First Slovenian to take a map from Starbuck. Yeah, ever. Exactly. Yeah, yeah ever. <laughs> Um, okay, so currently so it's 1-1, one, one. Yeah, hey, a bit one, one. perhaps not uh, uh, exactly expected uh, result, yeah. but Unexpected of course, turn of events. Yeah, exactly, a great play coming out from Ionis, 
um, defending that 13-13 uh, out from Starbuck and, and just from there on, so, sorry just yeah from there on out uh, Starbuck just went downhill and Yunus managed to take it oh now it's on Starbuck to choose a map and it's Cloud Kingdom okay we have Cloud Kingdom pretty relaxing map um, purple colors <coughs> I know s I, 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 Eonus is going to the <laughs> toilet, so yeah. In Feonic. Yeah. In Feonic. Okay. Yeah. Oops, I have to change myself. This is pretty awkward. Okay, so Starbucks choosing Cloud, King Cloud Kingdom. Um, so what can we say about quite this map for ZZBZ? It's, it's like a map where Mutalisk isn't perhaps the best to go for, since there are, there isn't so much space behind your bases, and you can't yeah. really... I mean. It's a good thing that you can uh, jump from 13 to the main ex uh, right on, but I mean, as soon as investors pop out, it's uh, the mutalist count is pretty much rendered useless. Since I mean, you have to do that damage early on. I mean, it's always like that. But this map, it's even more since um, yeah, yeah, true. And since the rush, this is pretty yeah, straightforward. Yeah, since um, you, you, it's not there's no deviation on any rush. It's just like a straight line to your base, to your third, to your expansion, and. I mean, Mutalisk perhaps are not the best choice here. Um, Ro Roach play is pretty popular here, and even bailing aggression because. Of yeah, bailing aggression because of the large map, uh, large ramp on your expansion, and. Um, yeah. We I think we're gonna see something like that coming out from, uh, Ionus. I I hope. I mean, I mean he has to feel confident right now after so much inactivity. And not playing and he, and winning against a Grandmaster Zerk uh, yeah. player that's dominant in true in Slovenia for over a year now. Um, oh, okay, Eonus is back, so yeah, we're all ready. Yep. We're gonna start the game. Yes. It's going to be WS WC, C, WC, CS, WCS Cloud Kingdom, and it's gonna be a deciding yeah. map, and the players are ready. So we'll be starting the game shortly. Yeah. Uh, by the way, guys, you are watching Connecting Slovenia Arena Season One. Uh, it's currently one-one. Um, Starbuck taking game one. Uh, Ian is taking game two. And we are now loading game number three in its Cloud Kingdom. Um, we already talked a little bit about the map. Uh, yeah, also totally about the opponents. Map. Yeah, and. Perhaps Just give me a second before you make an introduction. Yes, of course. Okay. So a few more seconds and here you go. Okay, oh. who goes for it? Okay. Why, why so okay, far? Uh, Eonus spawned as a orange zerk in the upper corner of the map. Yeah, That's yeah. fine. Okay, and Derailed Starbuck spawns as the Red Zerg. Currently, one one between the w between them. <laughs> yeah. Between the yeah, it is. yeah. Uh, okay, so right now we don't see any early pulls. I hoped for like a seven eight pull, but it's not really use. Uh, actually, it's not as good as uh, it is thought to be. Um, pretty much yeah, no standard coming out from both of them. Um, Do you Predict any hatch first here. Um, it's a map that you can easily take your hatch, uh, exp especially expansion, since the distance to your uh, hatchery is like uh, it's really uh, small. I mean, you just come down the ramp and there's your expansion. Not like uh, perhaps uh, Daybreak or um, or some other maps like Aculum Flats, the new map in an in instance. Yeah, so new maps are pretty. Yeah, but we can right now say that uh, Starbuck is going for 13, 13, both players went and also Ian is going builds. for 13, 13. So both, yeah, both players opening with that fast speed, and it's gonna be a time who's gonna click that faster speed uh, upgrade, and uh, the yeah, the one I, who I gets it faster. Matter for a few seconds. Nah, yeah, of course not. But perhaps Sniper Zergling too could do some good. So. Uh, Basically, it's gonna be a no, fast game. Micro. 
<laughs> yeah, that's that's most definitely. Um, and uh, the game is going to be short. It's not going to take a long time to finish, uh, most likely, since already players are uh, trying to tell us with this opening. Yeah, it depends how they defend, uh, right? And but Ionis is starting the faster speed. Oh, big mistake coming out from Starbuck, actually forgetting uh, one drone uh, I mean, he forgot to... Actually, he pulled one drone earlier before he shoot, and he didn't have the initial 100 gas. He had to re oh, re yeah. Yeah, but retake still, the speed gas. is only... Yeah, speed but it's basically a couple seconds. of seconds, five seconds, so that's not a big deal, of course. But just yeah, nice. small, a small mishap um, coming out from Starbuck. Uh, taking his expansion now, and as well, Ian is going for the same thing. Yeah. A bit faster uh -huh. expansion from Starbuck, basically yes. the same. And perhaps uh, both players are clash in the middle of the map. <laughs> yeah, a clash of titans. And I think since they both know what they're going for, I think they both scouted their fast uh, gas and uh, end pools. They probably some kind of a realize what's going on and probably don't want to just die to some stupid mistake and yeah, going a little actually sees the Starbuck actually sees the gas here, but uh, Aeronos doesn't have any scouting overlords near the main base. Yeah, so he doesn't know if, if uh, Starbuck is taking gas or not. And Ionis is... Uh, I mean, it's oh, hard to say. He's putting down a bailing nest. Yeah, both players are putting down bailing nest. Actually, that's... It's when identical it's identical timings again. Yeah, but it's pretty standard. I mean, in ZVZ, yeah, you timings. pretty much have to put down that bailing nest because bailings are useful throughout the game. Ionis uh, is moving out, so is Starbuck. We're yeah, see some links on the map now. An attempt uh, to for a run by from Ionis and Starbuck going for the same with a little bit more yeah. links than uh, Ionis. These links here can do some damage. Yeah, this Starbuck could actually kill back. a queen or two, and this uh, queen of Starbuck should perhaps fall. Not yeah, exactly. but Starbuck has more links here. Yeah, and uh, Ionis is in a bit of a trouble because basically lost all his zerglings in uh, Starbuck's main, and while losing uh, more zerglings and a uh, queen. Right now, in uh, his own well. base. Um, yeah, well, Starbuck defended flawlessly. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Two defensive mainlings. Exactly. So. I uh, think this queen was huge. Yeah, the queen was quite big because the injects on your expansion start to uh, really matter as soon as the game progresses. And right now, we can see six more links for Starbuck and eight more links for uh, Ionis and. A drone or two will one drone falls right now. A good, a good, a uh, um, good snipe coming out from Starbuck. Let's see who leads in drone. Starbuck leads Although, by one. Uh, There's a Yunus lot of bailing is here. He's preparing a big bailing uh, pressure, big bailing bust. Uh, oh, almost uh, losing. Oh no! What are you doing? Careful! Oh, big oh, mistake! Nice, nice blow. Big mistake by uh, uh, Ionis losing all those bailings to yeah. three bailings of uh, split them a bit apart. Yeah, and right now one bailing can't kill any drones, so he should just leave it. Yeah, and right now Starbuck uh, is in a big leg, big lead, uh, destroying the push, uh, basically defending with with almost zero casualties. Yeah. Uh, Ionis just didn't do the right decision. I mean, going into two queens, uh, banelings and zerglings isn't, and a spine crawler isn't perhaps the best thing to do. Yeah, it's a bit of a micro mistake. Got all banelings. They're both powering up with units, no drones. Yeah, but right now, uh, Unis started to remake uh, drones uh, and an additional spoke, uh, spine crawler, so he is probably looking for a bit of a later uh, game. Spyber, Spyber, Starbuck is doing two bailings, ninja bailings. Yeah, ninja bailings coming out from yeah. Starbuck. Probably trying to sneak into that expansion, snipes a couple of drones, and that would be actually a good job for Starbuck, really putting him uh, in a, uh, quite a small e or perhaps a middle economy, economy lead. Yeah. Um, but the uh, could be done by then. Or maybe not. Yeah, it's going to finish. One more, drones fall, one more drone fall for. Uh, Ionis and yeah. Starbuck <laughs> managed to snipe another drone. For two banelings. Yeah, and loses two banelings for two banelings. Um, Starbuck, Starbuck lost is actually added drones. Yeah, Starbuck killed four drones. drones? Uh, five drones mm -hmm. currently, and remaking, and we were making additional three. Um, Ionis sees those four banelings, and this could oh. be 
This could be big. This the one queen won't, damage, yeah. won't do, do that much. And Ionis has to split his drones up really good right now. Really, really good. Oh, careful. Yeah, okay. Oh, oh nice split. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, he lost two drones to those uh, Forza uh, Bailing. So good job yeah. from Ionis. Although a bit of a mishap for getting those three drones. Um, if he would trigger the explosion faster, he could take down like. Yeah, drones. like five, six drones. Uh, and currently, Roach Warren and Double Evo Chamber from uh, Starbuck coming out and going for the Double Evo, oh, most likely. Part, yeah. A lot of uh, Zerglings, not terrain. Also, a him. bit of a faster lair for uh, Ionis, have to say, taking all four gases as well. So perhaps Ionis wants to go for the Mutalisk. Uh, and we talked yeah, about. It like it. Yeah, and t like we talked, uh, it's not that popular to go Mutalisk and Cloud Kingdom, especially since there's not much room to. Uh, to micro when uh, investors come out and I mean yeah. he has to do that he damage. Also made the roach warm, but this is defense of roach warm, I Yeah, think. I mean you usually go mutilist then transition into a roach uh, some kind of a push as soon as you force uh, a lot of spore cars or something. Indigo, you're lagging. <laughs> oh, sorry. Stop downloading porn, son. <laughs> <laughs> He um, should have at least two evil chambers for so much gas, so this is definitely mutas. Okay, Spire coming down. He knows about the two evils from Starbucks, so why would he make one if, unless he doesn't need it, right? But but this Roach push from Starbucks, which is piling up right now, could do damage before mutalis. Yep, exactly, and he put down his third as well, so mm -hmm. he got nice. that. A lot of bait here for Starbucks also. I think he knows what he's up against. Um, he didn't see any roaches on the terrain. Yeah, Ian is going for uh, his third. And I mean, is if uh, Ian is lagging a little bit again. Oh, um, shit. I'm sorry. No, 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 it's no problem. Um, and Starbuck actually yeah. has to realize that it's a uh, spire place. And, and he did. He yeah. yeah, he al al also scouted. But I mean, usually when you go, you, when you play versus a Zerg and you only see Banings and nice Zerglings. Nice now for Ionis. He yeah, doing three yeah, nice for three bandings. Uh But look at the middle of the map. Starbucks yeah. roaches are on the way. This and is right a lot of roaches. SUV approach. bus, but it's a yeah, a roach bus. Bus. And right now, Star uh, Ion Ionis is uh, in trouble if he doesn't do if he doesn't defend this because yeah, he roaches, doesn't have enough. He has one the roaches will have on his yeah. Feelings. Also, the roaches will have one one complete, and he has to be careful about that. Yeah, one one is very near to be complete. Yeah, and going uh, behind the mineral nice line. Nice position. Nice. Uh, uh, Bailing's only detonating and a couple of roaches. And Very nice we position. See, we see that the roaches. Oh, bad manner out of. Oh my god, what a bad manner player. Oh, damn. Um, Indigo leaving, what? Yeah, yeah sorry. I was left. I was oh, uh, he didn't speak to mean, me. Yeah, you know, yeah. Okay, um, so we well basically the mutalisks are now out, only one muta, five more on the way, roaches for Ionis already, but he managed to clean this up, uh, yeah, lose... but I think the Starbuck, has, he already has Hydra, Hydra yeah. and Spore Crawlers in place. And so. plus two missile attack with plus one uh, carapace already complete and third base already up and running before uh, Ionis. And I think Ionis um, has little to no chance to come back here. I mean, with those four uh, Mutalisk, of course, he can do something. But with Hydralisk and Spore Claws and Queens already out, there will be no damage. And with the Queens, uh, with the push coming out with Roach Hydra, I think uh, Starbuck will close this up with 2-1 two two one, two one win. But we shouldn't count uh, Ionis, of course, out. No way, no how. Um, Ionis actually cancelling the plus two missile attack, going for the plus one carapace on flyer. Mutilus. Uh, an interesting choice, perhaps. I don't know if it's the best choice, but I mean, he has so little Mutilus, I don't know if they'll be really as useful as they could have been. Yeah, I don't know how. Um, Eonus will stop this big push coming from Starbuck. Yeah, and Starbuck uh, has plus two missile attack uh, already third on the way with uh, twi three times as ro many roaches as uh, Eonus and uh, also Hydra is in the battle and 
Yeah, I mean, six bangings won't do a lot. Only if they hit Hydra slightly. Yeah, down, Hydra really should hard. be it, but the mutilists are already, already falling. Uh, we can see only six mutilists on the map already, so. Uh, damage done by Starbuck is not just massive, it's, it's actually game ending, and we should see a GG pretty much soon right here. Uh, the natural will fall air GG. coming GG from Eunice. And GG. Starbuck. Wins this with uh, win this series with two one, a decisive series showing um, good play in game one, and losing in game two. Uh, Aeon is showing great game in uh, actually good uh, choices, uh, great uh, play in game two. Not the best perhaps in game three going for the mutalisk, but still both players are great players. Props to both, especially Starbuck winning, and this uh, puts him two zero in.